Welcome back to Lolly TV. I'm your host, Aubrey Strobel, and let's start with the top Bitcoin headlines of the week. Let's start with Bitcoin's price. So sort of a slow, quiet week for Bitcoin after the news of the new Omicron variant is out. So many variants, so little time. Bitcoin, COVID don't perform historically well together. Little known fact. Perhaps the biggest piece of news this week, because there were a lot of big headlines this week, but the biggest one has to be Grubhub is now live on Lolly. You can earn $5 in free Bitcoin if you're a new user and then $1 in Bitcoin on every reoccurring order after that point. And so this is big news for people like me who basically order every meal in, which I should not do and whatever, but now I don't feel guilty about it because I'm earning free Bitcoin back. Anyways, we are thrilled to have Grubhub a part of Lolly. So this was a very exciting launch. Jack Dorsey stepped down as Twitter CEO this week. Parag Arabwal, the CTO, former CTO, is taking his spot, who is apparently bullish on Bitcoin, but we will see. He also announced that Square is going to be named Block and Square Crypto is going to be named Spiral. So some interesting rebranding and naming that I personally think it's sort of a response to Zuckerberg renaming Facebook meta after wanting to build the metaverse on an ethereum future and jack sort of saying that he's going to build bitcoin what else happened this week crypto.com announced its plans to acquire two other exchanges in the first half of 2022 so competition for market share in the exchange world is just heating up and Fidelity launched a spot Bitcoin ETF in Canada. Maybe it'll happen in the US soon. It hasn't happened for a spot ETF for Bitcoin yet. Personally, I will always just tell you, I think you should just own Bitcoin outright. And now it's time to pick up your phone and follow Lolly on Instagram if you have not already, because it's time for Bitcoin Meme of the Week. This week's winner is Bitcoin Batty for this submission. It says, is now a good time to buy Bitcoin and it's your family at Thanksgiving. This triggers PTSD for me. So five lollipops, congratulations on the win. And now for the best Bitcoin back deals on lolly.com. Check out booking.com. You can get 6% back for holiday hotel bookings and winter getaways. Walgreens is giving you 8% back for all your daily essentials, including stocking stuffers. Sennheiser is doing 8% back for the perfect gift for the music lover in your life. And now we're going to give away $50 in free Bitcoin, which we do every single show. So make sure that you like and subscribe so that you never miss an episode. And this week, I would like you to drop your lolly sats tag in the comments and pick a number one through 100. Closest number that we're thinking of will win the $50 in free Bitcoin. Like always, thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you back here next week. Strobel out.